And again, I, we all let you know our names. And I'd like to engage in some conversation, but you're not really speaking to me. I don't want some man. You're the Smith. What? Edgar, you've been warned you're trespassing. All right. Let go. What's going on, guys? It's sort of the product news. This video comes to us from a rising star in the auditing community. Caught you slipping audits. Here, he's at a police station in Phoenix, Arizona, I believe. And because it's late at night, the police officers are saying that he doesn't have the right to take pictures there. Well, uh, we live in a 24-hour community. People work second shift, third shift. Two o'clock in the morning might be one o'clock in the afternoon to somebody else. And how is it that police cannot grasp the concept of any government building is owned by the people? It's public property. Oh, that's, that, that's not public property. That's state-owned property. Oh, my God. Forehead slap. But I don't want to get into that because I'll just go into a diatribe. Anyways, let's watch this video. It's raw body camera footage. So without further ado, let's start the show. Oh. How are you tonight? You doing okay? I'm Sergeant Katz with the Phoenix Police Department. Can I help you with anything this evening? No, sir. If you don't have any official police business and you don't need our help, I would ask you to step into the park, please, and off the um, city property. Is that something you're willing to do for me, please? No. And how come? You don't know. What is the purpose of you filming this evening? What's the purpose? Well, I'm obviously testing out my new 360 camera that's compatible with YouTube upload. Somebody doesn't read the Wall Street Journal. Comes from the new Italian tech startup company, Nanya. That's right. Nanya. Nanya Business. Name and batch number? I'm sorry? What's your name and batch? Carnes. Sergeant Carnes. Batch number? Uh, it's right there on my badge. You can't uh, see. I'm, oh. I'm very blind, man. Trust All me. All right, it's 8714. Thank you very much. I'm very blind. I understand. So I appreciate oh. you engaging me in conversation now. What is your name? So I showed you some respect, and, and we're having this conversation. You are on police property. You, you don't state that you have any business with the police. Name and badge. So with that being said... Name and badge. If you I do can't not, tell if you're who you're talking to. Well, take a wild guess, sweetheart, because I think he's going to go around asking everybody. And there's a common thread in this uh, video. This woman's completely confused over and over again. Name and badge. Stimic, 6028. Name and badge. City O, 10365. Thank you very much. Name and badge. Ben, 10864. Thank you very much. So if there is something I can help you with, I'd love to help you. If you don't have any reason to be here, please matter, I would ask you to step into the pocket, please. And again, I, we all let you know our names, and I can kind of appreciate what you're doing. That sounds sincere. And I'd like to engage in some conversation, but you're not really speaking to me. I don't want to, man. You're just miss. You're good. You're well, good so that's go. the thing. No, I have, to, I have to stay here and see what's going on. I, I have a... Am I uh, detained? Obligation. Am I detained? You are not detained. You are free to leave. Please, if you'd I'm like to, to go stay. ahead. Thank you. But that's the thing you can't... Yeah, he got him with the oldest trick in the book. Now, there was one time uh, talk of me getting a contract to do continual education for a whole Chicago department on how to deal with citizens who have cameras. Um, but... I backed out of it. It's all about improvement, but I backed out of it. But interesting side note, it was started by a member of another department, not the police. This gentleman got a hold of uh, infamous former Chicago mobster um, to get the message to me because he knew we knew each other. Now, if you can come up with a video the title, or what video it was that 
that discussion took place after, because this department was thoroughly embarrassed by not knowing the law. They were completely wrong about a law they should have known. And it's a common law that they always try and uh, use and always get the first person to come up with the title or at least a description of that video, I will send a DPN care package to. A very, very nice one. And I'm sure ASD Docs will send you $100 also. I haven't asked him yet, but we'll put him down for 100 No, I'm just kidding. Anyways, let's get back to the video. That's the thing. You can't stay here. So. By all means, you can go into the park. Um, but if you don't have any police business, if you don't need us for anything or to make a police report, you can't stay on this property. So we're going to ask you one more time. It's time to leave if you don't have, if you don't need our help. Well, who's the supervisor here? Me, and and him. Okay, so you should know this is legal, right? Yeah, you're you're okay to be in the park if you if you want to film whatever you want to do. How do you do. know I don't have police business right now? I, I'm telling you what what our policy is, and this is legal. If you don't have any business here, you need to leave. Not a lawful order. Thank you, you're dismissed. You're dismissed as well. Thank you very much. So, you, should be, you should know better. So I respect you're what you're dismissed. doing, mm -hmm. and, and I'd like a little bit of respect that I'm giving you. No, nah, man, you can have me very wrong. Unfortunately, Sorry, sir. you lost my respect. I'm if, not, I'm not if you don't no have police business, and you do want to stay here, we will have to give you that Have a nice night. Going the wrong way, brother. The park. The park is up that way, so time to leave. You're not going to kick me out, I'm sorry. You're dismissed, though. Oh, and you can't dismiss us. We're on our own property here, dear. Yeah, I am, too. So, since you... You can't dismiss us. We're on our own property here, dear. She 110% believes that wholeheartedly. Uh, and it's crazy. Uh, the best analogy is, okay, so you're rich and you're having a mansion party, right? And... You hire her and the other officers as security. It's her job to make sure that everybody um, is able to express themselves, um, is able to uh, enjoy themselves without being harassed or hurt. Or um, it's, it's their job to work security. See, they're part of the government. It's the government's job to uphold the citizens' rights. They're just security. They don't own the mansion because they work security at the party. That's insane lie. Now, when they're off of work, they're a citizen and they're afforded the same liberties in the Constitution that the rest of us are. But the government protects and upholds our constitutional rights. They don't have constitutional rights. Well, that's not completely true anymore either because they have something called LIBOR now, Law Enforcement Bill of Rights, because they realize if a cop breaks the law while on duty, he needs a Fifth Amendment right. So they do have some rights while working as an agent of the government. Do you have any identification with you? You suspect me of a crime? Uh, yes, at this point in time I do. What crime? Uh, you are loitering, you are trespassing, loitering, and trespassing. you are in a, uh, a city property, and okay. you don't have any reason wow. to be there at this point. Wow. Waste. Uh, what's your reason? Are you detaining me? I can't hear you. Am I detained? Uh, you're going to be. If we're, we're going to give you one more warning, you need to leave. It's time to leave or you're going to be detained. You can, you'll be detained for trespassing. But this is public property. This here is actually police property. If you don't have any business right. here, you have funded to funded by the taxpayers, right? I still can't hear you. You're just dying right there. This is not trespassing, sir. And, and the throwing the light in the eye yeah, is getting, no kid. getting old. I'm not so, doing nothing so, wrong. I'm okay, nothing so we've wrong. given you three I'm really warnings. I'm doing nothing wrong, so. Okay. What, what, what are you guys? What, what are you guys tripping about? I'm not. I'm not There's no about. tripping. You all you literally have to do is walk right across what this driveway. What does that have to do with anything? And though? you can go into a public park. No, I'm going to so if you don't are go you into recording? a public park, Absolutely. you're going to be you're no, going to be not. detained. You're, you're recording. So now you're just causing trouble. 
So I would no, like to ask you to walk across the street. I need you to back away. No, okay. I will not, sir. That, that needs like, to what, go. The, okay. what are you guys doing? Let's break your camera. Let's break your camera. Wow, what are you guys doing? Let go, let go, let go. I'm not, no, let like, go. No, yeah, watch, I'm watch, step back, step back. Oh my god. Step back. No, my phone. Oh, okay. my, my left wrist is injured. All right, stay chill. Step. Well, what are you arresting Can we step for? him back for? You're well, being detained right now for trespassing. What trespassing? Or what? On public property? No, you're on police or property. We already explained it, dear. Wow, you guys are, you guys are insane. What's going on with you guys? Are you serious? So we are super serious. Unfortunately, you did this to yourself this mm -hmm. evening. Okay. And now your body cam is recording, right? Yeah. So, Yours? so from here on out, yes, sir. Okay. Mm -hmm. Your cooperation will speak worlds for what's going to happen. Flee my fifth. You guys can okay. arrest me. Go cool. ahead, man. We haven't done nothing wrong. What's that? Welcome into booking. Yeah. Oh, okay. So what I'm doing right now, sir, is because you are under arrest. Okay. I'm conducting a search of you. Do you have anything on you that I don't consent about? to a search, by the way. Well, search you're, under arrest. you're under arrest. You can't. Okay. Consent. I haven't committed a crime. You have a property bag. I don't have one. Well, on I got a mace right here. So be careful. You have pepper Thank you. Thank you for letting me know. Anything else that you know about? No, I just search for my body cam. <clears throat> what charges are you guys arresting? Trespassing? You're what charges? You're being for trespassing right now. What charges? Is that yours? I or? just... Did this dizzy chicken just say, do I have to repeat myself three times? If that's not the pot calling, you know the rest. Who's on first? What's on second? Third base? What are you arresting me for? I don't consent to arrest you anymore. You guys just got it for the menu, right? Yeah. Right. You guys should have known better. I'm just recording, not breaking the law, man. <laughs> hey, I can, I can feel that you're, you're shaking. Cause you're yeah, because I'm scared. I'm surrounded by four guys with, with four guns. What deep, the fuck? Deep, you're the safest person <laughs> in Phoenix right now. You're surrounded not by really, police. guys. You guys are committing a huge fucking right, crime right now, guys. Hi, right, record me! Record me, they're arresting me for returning. They're saying it's, it's private uh, property. Call me, I'm not, I'm not breaking no laws. Record me, bro. That's it. They're tripping over me recording, guys. You got it? I'm still, I'm still on right now, too. I'd have to look at my watch as soon as you There you go. 9.25, sir. Have a good night. We'll see you at court, sir. Oh, trust me. You guys will see me back right now.
Please leave your message for. Hey, Edward. This one of the few I get to stand. Look what we got here. We got sweet cheeks. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying, girl? I'm gonna learn today. I'm gonna learn today. Put your ass up. I'm gonna lost my respect, girl. You're welcome to stay on the park. Do not cross over the park. Shut the fuck up. Don't tell me what to do. You're gonna learn today. You're gonna learn today. Don't go to my vehicle. Do you understand? Shut up. Don't tell me what to do. You'll see. You're gonna learn how to respect the public. This way. Okay. Oh, fuck these guys. What? Edgar, you've been warned you're, you're trespassing. Alright. Let go. Oh, what the fuck, dude? Ah! Oh. oh, my wrist, bro! What the fuck? Oh! Don't grab your wrist, bro. Bro, that hurts. I got an injury. So that was my man, Caught You Slipping Audits, a man that I believe is going to be the first pick in the 2022 auditing draft. He's a star in the making. Really quick, I was talking to my friend, uh, Johnny 5 name dropping. He got arrested and his head split open for recording at the Santa Barbara Public Library. And at the risk of tuning my own horn, I have to say it's some of the best content DPN has ever posted. Reagan Fitzgerald Peabody, superintendent of the Civilian Division Office out of Chicago, made an emergency phone call to the Santa Barbara Police Department. I'll put the link for that, uh, this, that, that, vid, that video, that content, that phone call. In the description, you guys got to listen, it's fantastic. And the link to Johnny's regular channel and his live channel 
His link will be in the description. I have a habit of giving different channels um, nicknames, like uh, Chuck Bronson. I call him the Iron Man because he can go out cop watching, auditing for 17 hours straight. Joe Cool is the governor because we play a game where he's got 11 minutes and uh, somebody in the live um, names a channel, the most random uh, channel they can think of, and Joe's got 11 minutes to get in contact with him. He knows everybody. ASD Docs, I call my secret weapon, and Johnny 5 I call the king of the live. He could be playing a ukulele in the middle of a forest with no lights on a live, and he'll have 1,100 people in the room. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and thanks for supporting me when I was away uh, dealing with the medical issue. I want to thank you guys for supporting me and still watching my videos when I was dealing with a very, very serious health problem, which I still am dealing with. Uh, it was said one time by ASD Docs that I have the most loyal subscribers in the community. And then it was rebutted by another uh, channel, auditing channel, and he said he thinks he has the most loyal subscribers in the community. Problem with that is, I never said I had the most loyal subscribers in the community. I mean, I know I do, but somebody else said that. He comes back and says, no, I got the most loyal. Yeah, I know. Your grandma thinks you're the most handsome person in the world, and your mom believes that you're going to grow up to be president, even when you're 42. Anyways, my name is Disorder the Park News. Don't forget about that question. The first one to put in the comment section will get a DPN care package. What that is, I don't know yet. But have a great week. Good night.